DJ here with the Chief Peak, and today we're going to be doing a chest, back, and shoulder focused dumbbell workout. So for this workout, we're going to be doing 12 total exercises, and we're going to be doing them in groups of triceps, which is three exercises to a set. We're going to do four sets of each tricep. Our working time is 30 seconds, our break time is 15 seconds, and in between the groups of triceps, we will then take a 30 second extended break. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you wanna see more, subscribe to the channel. And if you're looking to get stronger or more toned, go check out our programs we have available. Now let's get to work. We got about 30 seconds until we begin. Our first exercise is gonna be high crossover. So let's grab our dumbbells. For high crossovers, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a nice wide base stance. We're not going to rotate the torso. Instead, we're gonna bring the arm up and across the body, working the upper chest. So we've got a couple seconds until we begin. Let's get ready. Here we go. So we're bringing it up at about a 45 degree angle, keeping the elbow down. So the elbow should not be for, uh, pointing away from you. Uh, here we go. Try to get it up there a little higher. If this is too tough. You can do low crossover. Just bring it right across your body. Although we also have those in this workout as well. If it's too tough, then you may just need to drop weight. Here we go. So we're going to hang on to those dumbbells. We're going to go into reverse grip row. So what we're going to do is we're going to have our palms facing away from us. We're gonna bend at the knees and hips, and then we're gonna drive the elbows back and up, bring the weight to our hips. There we go, so from the knees to the hips. You can literally drag it right up the thigh. Push those elbows back, good controlled movements here, get that squeeze, there we go. Focus on what you're doing, forget about everything else. There we go, squeeze, one more, squeeze, there we go, okay, next, we're going into a shoulder press, so we're bringing it up right here, our elbows are going to be just inside, or just in front of our shoulders from here, we're going to press it up, come back down, so here we go, shoulder press all the way up, all the way down, again, the elbows should stay out in front of the shoulder, so they shouldn't be back here. They should be in like that. Good controlled movements. If your dumbbells are a little bit heavy for you and you can't go any lighter, then you can kind of get into a little half squat and help force and get some momentum going for those as well if you need. There we go. 15 seconds. We're going into our second set of high crossovers. Again, if you need to, drop weight. Here we go. Bring it up and across. Squeezing. Make sure to get a nice stance. Try not to rotate the torso. We're not doing this. We're coming across like that. Here we go. If you want, you can just do one side each time. Really burn that muscle up or you can alternate. There we go. Going into reverse grip rows here. Moving right along. Remember when you're doing uh, anything bending over, nice straight back. Unless otherwise stated, always keep a nice straight back. Here we go. So from the knees to the hips, driving the elbows backwards, keeping the palms facing away from us. Here we go, you should feel it in the lat. Here we go, 10 seconds. Nice straight back, push that chest out, head up. Helps keep the back straight. Let's get one more. Here we go. Okay, we got a shoulder press coming up. Get ready. 
Always pick the weights up with your legs, not with your back. Here we go. Shoulder press all the way up, all the way down. Good controlled movements. Here we go. One more. There we go. Feeling good. Going back into high crossovers. You got 10 seconds. Get some water if you need it. Here we go. Let's get ready. Here we go. Good controlled movements. Feel that squeeze in the chest. Make sure to be focusing on it. Elbows down. Squeeze that chest. Focus on using that muscle. 10 seconds. Come on. Wow, we're exhausting it. A little pre exhaust, real quick, before the real fun begins. There we go. Reverse grip rows. Coming up. Here we go. Remember, palms out, bend at the knees, bend at the hips. From the knee to the hip. That's where we're dragging it. Elbows back. Come on. Squeeze. Squeeze that back. Come on. Feel it. Here we go. Halfway. Come on. Let's go. Squeeze it. Get that contraction of the back. Squeeze. Squeeze. There we go. One more. Shoulder press. Feeling it back there now. There we go. Let's get ready for shoulder press. We go make sure to have the elbows in front of the shoulders. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Let's go. There we go. All right, set three coming up. Going into high crossovers. Let's get ready. Nice wide stance. Here we go. Bringing the arm across and up. Arm across and up. Focus on that chest. Should be feeling it in the upper part of the chest. If you're doing low crossovers, you're gonna feel it in the lower center part of the chest. Keep the elbow down. One more. Woo, there we go. Starting to break a sweat now. we go. Going into rows. Reverse grip rows here. Come on. Palms out. Pulling the elbows back. Squeezing that back. Squeeze. Here we go. Squeeze. Keep the back straight. Chest out. Head up. One more. Woo, there we go. All right, we got shoulder press coming up. And then after that, we got a 30 second break and we're moving on. Here we go. All the way up, all the way down. Remember if it starts getting a little too heavy, you can kind of cheat squat it up. A little quarter squat, get some momentum going, help you push it up. Here we go. Keep a nice stance. Ah. Ah. 
Let's go. One more. Here we go. All right, we got a 30 second break, and then we're moving on. We're gonna be going into shrug high pulls. So we got shrug high pulls, and then crush press. We're gonna be laying down on the ground. So shrug high pulls. We get a shrug, and then we're gonna do the high pull. Shrug, high pull. Here we go. Let's get ready. Demonstrate from the side too. So shrug it up, and then high pull. Shrug it up, high pull. When you're doing the high pull, push those elbows back. Uh, try to get as high as you can. Squeeze in the traps. That trap is up here, connects the shoulder and the neck. It's right in there, come on. Squeeze. Get that shrug, get it contracted. Get that high pull, try to squeeze it just a little bit more. So we're going down the crush press. Lay down in between your dumbbells. From here, we're going to put our dumbbells together and then do a press. We're just gonna hold them there. So we're not bringing them apart. Traditional press is like that. We are not doing that. Nope. We're keeping it together, bringing it down, pushing it up. Bringing it down, pushing it up. Here we go. Come on. Let's go. Here we go. All right, and we're going into bent over, reverse flies. I'm gonna leave those there. Get a little bit lighter of a weight. So with these, we're gonna bend over, again, nice straight back, and we're going to pull them up and back. Here we go. So it's like if you were laying on the ground doing a fly, and you were coming up here and squeezing, we're just starting the opposite. We're starting down here, and then we're bringing it up and back. Again, maintaining. That nice straight back. You're gonna have a, a slight bend in the elbows and then you're gonna hold that bend. So you're just gonna bend them there and then lock it. There we go. Going into shove high pull. Let's get ready. We got five seconds. Second set coming up. There we go. Shrug, high pull. Shrug, high pull. Shrug, high pull. There we go. Keep it moving. Focus on that muscle. Squeezing and contracting the, the traps. Let's go. Ah. Ah. There we go. Drop the dumbbells to the ground. Lay down in between them. There we go. From here we're gonna bring them up. Touch them together and we're gonna do our press. There we go. Good controlled movements. There we go. Feeling good. As you can see, that weight's coming pretty low compared to my chest. It's not actually coming down on my chest at all. It's a little bit lower, more over my abdomen. There we go. There we go. All right, reverse fly. Then over reverse flies. Here we go. Let's get ready. These are maybe a little bit too difficult for you, then what I want you to do is a high row. So a bent over high row, you're gonna row it and kind of bring the weight up to your neck area. That's where it should be coming up like that. A normal row is gonna be down here. We're gonna come up like that. So a little option for you. There we go. One more. There we go. Feeling good. Set two is down. Set three. 
Get ready for shrug high pulls. So shrug, high pull. Shrug, high pull. Shrug, high pull. Come on, squeeze. Feel that burn. Embrace it. You can also just do shrugs if you need to. There we go. All right, crush press. Let's get ready. So we'll bring the weights together, hold it there. We're gonna bring it down, press it out. Bring it down, press it out. Keeping the weight together. Dumbbells stay together. There we go. Try to push them together. Oh, there we go. Feel it in the chest. Come on. There we go. All right, been over reverse flies. Coming up. Here we go. Let's go. Here we go. Good controlled movements. Come on. Let's go. Feeling good. Ah, come on. Push it. Five seconds. Let's go. Push yourself. There we go. Going into high pulls. Last set right here. Let's get ready. Here we go. Shrug, high pull. Shrug, high pull. Shrug, high pull. Let's go. Push it. Come on. Burn it up. Let's go. Shrug. Now right, pull. Last one. Drop those dumbbells. Lay down in between them. Here we go. Feeling good. Got two more exercises left. We got an extended break. Here we go. Bring them together. Bring them down. Press them. Here we go. Try to push those hands together. Really feel it contract on the center of the chest. Good controlled movements. Oh yeah. Come on. Woo, there we go. Feeling good. All right, bend over reverse fly. Get ready. Remember, still having a nice straight back here. We're not bending over doing this. Nice straight back. Chest out, head up. Oh. Come on. Let's go. There we go. All right, we got a 30 second break and then we're moving on. Going into wide push ups. All right, so wide push ups. Here we go, we're gonna get down to the ground. Normal push ups, wide push ups. It might even help to kind of put your hands at 10 and two. And from there, we're gonna push up. Just like that. Let's go. Good controlled movements all the way up, all the way down. If you want, you can even 
point your hands get more of like a nine and three to help out feel it in the, the outer part of the chest let's go don't forget to breathe always breathe abs nice and tight one more here we go all right we're going on to a single arm row so we'll grab a bigger dumbbell here we're gonna do one side each time so I'm gonna start off with the left and we're gonna row with one if you don't have heavier dumbbells then you can just do your rows with both hands each time so you would just be doing yours like that get that squeeze at the top remember to keep a nice straight back let's go come on one more there we go leave this over here now we're going into lateral raise so lateral raise from the side we're bringing it out and back down here we go so when you're doing a lateral raise keep the thumb slightly above the pinky you might also have to kind of come like this and then go out either option is fine just try to feel it in the outer part of the shoulder come on there we go all right we're going back in to wide push-ups here we go so we're gonna keep those hands nice and wide there we go come down come up down up let's go good controlled movements come on if you need to drop down your knees that's fine just keep pushing let's go Woo, there we go all right going into single arm row here switching sides i'm doing my right side this time let's get ready Come on, let's go, push it, come on, halfway, push it, let's get that squeeze back there, come on, squeeze, 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 there we go. I felt great. All right, lateral raise. Come on. Here we go. Remember, if you need, you can kind of start here, elbows at like a 90, and then come up. And as you get stronger, bring it a little further out each time. Just focus on the shoulders and getting that burn and contraction on the shoulders, not in the traps. There we go. All right, set three coming up. Doing wide push ups again. Here we go. Let's get ready. Nice wide, wide, uh, wide hands. Point the fingers at ten and two. All the way down. All the way up. All the way down. All the way up. Here we go. Ah, come on, let's go. What are you made of? Abs ah, nice and tight. Don't be cheating. Here we go. All right, going back in a single arm row. Whew. Sweating now. 
Let's go. Let's get ready. Pull it up and get that squeeze. Squeeze right there. Squeeze. Make sure to get that contraction back there. Embrace that burn. Let's go. Last one. Woo, there we go. It's feeling good. Lateral raises. Couple seconds. Here we go. Make sure to keep the thumb above the pinky. Good controlled movements. There we go. Come on. Right there. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! All right, high grip push-ups. Burning them up. Here we go. Come on. Let's go. Feel it in that chest. Try to keep the elbows back. We're down. You can see where my elbows are. They should not be out here. They need to be down. Like you're trying to squeeze them into your side. Come on. Let's go. Ah, one more. Ah, woo! There we go. Single arm row. Whew. Moving right along. Whew. Here we go. Let's get ready. Ah. Let's go. Come on. Feel it. Embrace that burn. That's where the gains are made. Let's go. Woo! There we go. All right. Lateral raise. Let's do this. After this, we got 30 seconds and we're moving on. Let's go. Up, get that squeeze. Down, up, down. Always nice controlled movements. Remember if it gets too heavy, bring them here, come out. Focus on that outer part of the shoulder. Thumb above the pinkies. There we go. You know, that's what I'm talking about. All right, we got a 30 second break. We're moving on to good morning. This is gonna be the lower back movement. Right here. So, we are going to grab our dumbbell. It does not have to be a heavy dumbbell. And this is one of the only times I'm gonna tell you to bend at the lower back. And then come up. Here we go. So now we're bending at the lower back, and then we're coming up. At the lower back, and then we're coming up. You do not have to overload this. We are not trying to cause back injury. We're trying to prevent it by slowly strengthening the lower back muscles. There we go. Good controlled movements. All right, we grab our dumbbells. We're gonna go into a low crossover. So, low crossover, get a nice wide stance. We're gonna bring the dumbbell across. Arm stays super close to the body. So as the arm comes across and it gets out here, try to lift it up and squeeze, you'll feel it. 
Feel it in that lower chest. We're not rotating like that. That doesn't really do anything for us. We're coming across, squeeze, across, squeeze that chest. Squeeze that chest. One more. Ah. Woo, there we go. All right, we'll switch into a bent Y raise. So we're gonna bend over at the hips, not at the back. And from here, we're gonna lift into a Y. So, uh, Y, and we are staying slightly bent forward the entire time. The elbows are slightly bent, but locked. So we're gonna lock them there and then come up. There we go. So we're not here doing this. We're lean. One more. There we go. Back to good mornings. Here we go. Let's get ready. Here we go. Bending at the back this time. And over. Come up. Nice controlled movements. As your back gets stronger, then you can add weight. Remember, this is injury prevention. One more. There we go. Little crossover. Woo! Feeling it. Here we go. Here we go. Bring it across and squeeze. Across and squeeze. Come on. Squeeze. 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 Don't rotate the torso. Ah, one more. Ah, woo! There we go. Going into a bent Y raise. There we go. Let's go. Remember, slightly bent over, and then from here we're gonna bring it up and back down. Up and back down. Good controlled movements. Ah. Ah, feeling that back. Oh yeah, it's starting to burn. Ah, ah. Woo. there we go. Going back to good mornings. There we go. Feeling it in the back now. Oh yeah. Let's get ready for good mornings. Here we go. Bending at the lower back. Nice controlled movements. Come back up. We're not trying to snatch the weight. We're not going super fast. Just nice and controlled. Focus on that low back. Let's go. You can also, if you need to, just keep your arms like this. And do it like that as well. Here we go. Low crossover. Let's go. Third set. Let's get ready. Bring it across. Squeeze. Bring it across. Squeeze. Focus on the chest when you're doing this. Think about it. Squeeze the chest. I'm squeezing the chest. Coming across, squeezing the chest. Coming across, squeezing the chest. Elbow down. Squeeze. Squeeze. Woo. There we go. Coming into our bent Y raise. Let's go. 
We're bending, bending at the hips, not at the lower back. Bringing the weight up. Slight bend in the elbows, holding that bend. <clears throat> We're not doing a W raise where you come like this and you do bend at the elbows. <sighs> Feel it back there. <sighs> Come on, let's go. Ah. Woo, here we go. All right, we're going into our final set right here. Good mornings. Let's go. Again, if you need to, you can hold the weight like this and then slowly bend at the lower back like you were doing an RDL, except now you are bending at the lower back. Or, you can hold it up here. Here we go. Nice controlled movements. Come on. Woo, felt good right there. Now I'm feeling it back there. Here we go. Little crossovers. Come on, we got two more left. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Ah, squeeze that chest. Bring it across. Squeeze. Bring it across. You can see how it's staying nice and close to me. There we go. Ah, squeezing that chest. Ah. When you get to here, squeeze that chest. One more. There we go. All right, on to our last one right here. Bent Y raise, bent Y raise. Whew, almost done, almost done. Slide bend forward from here. Bring it up. Bring it up, good controlled movements. Don't forget to breathe, let's go. Come on. Let's get one more. Woo, there we go. That's what I'm talking about right there. I felt good. Whew. All right, you know the drill. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you wanna see more, subscribe to the channel. And if you're looking to get stronger or more tone, go check out the programs we have available. See you guys.